Now, some of you might be asking, why am I watching someone standing on top of a very large cliff when I'm supposed to be finding out about textile finishing? Well, it might sound a little overdramatic, but the reason we're here is to demonstrate that for some people, getting the right physical finish really is a matter of life and death. Go. Go. Of course, there's always a small chance the parachute won't open. But even if it does, it's vital that the material it's made from lets the right amount of air through it. And that's where calendaring comes in. By closing the pores in the fabric, calendaring restricts the airflow through it, so parachutists don't hit the ground too fast. It might sound simple, but it's very easy to calendar a fabric too much, and that can have disastrous consequences. If you produce a fabric that allows no air through at all, what will happen is when the parachute opens, it'll just split aside at the seams because the air will rush in and it will just burst it. Um, so obviously you don't want that to happen. So you've got to have a certain amount of air flow through it. And this is where the spec comes in. It controls exactly the right amount of air flow through the parachute. He might not be an adrenaline junkie, but when it comes to parachute fabric, there's not much Chris Ware doesn't know. As finishing supervisor, it's his job to make sure that every metre gets calendared to the right specification. The base materials are loaded onto the machine and passed through a metal detector. Even the smallest particle could damage the calendar's rollers, also called its bowls. Next, it's onto a chemical bath. The solution acts as a lubricant and will help fibres move across each other later on. Excess fluid is removed by passing the fabric over a vacuum and then it's on to the calendaring bowls themselves. Your bottom roller is being cooled, the top roller is heated. There's also pressure applied to the two bowls. The pressure runs into about 80 tonnes usually. The fabric then passes through the bowls and in passing through the bowls the weft fibres in the, in the fabric are being closed up together. The idea being to uh, improve the amount of air that goes through the cloth, in other words to restrict it slightly. 